A Wildcat football star is out of the legal woods for now. The Tucson City Attorney's Office says there just is not enough evidence to convict running back Kadeem Carey, so they are dropping the charges against him. Not on your side's Maggie Vespa is here with more. That's right, Jen. The biggest hang-up here, prosecutors say a key witness, possibly Carey's ex-girlfriend, the alleged victim in this case, is simply unavailable. And legal experts say when that happens, a domestic violence case like this can crumble like a house of cards. It is the case heard round Wildcat World. Yeah, I've heard about it. It's been around campus, just kids talking about it. All American running back Kadeem Carey charged in December with abusing his then pregnant girlfriend, pushing her, slamming her fingers in a door. Carey, under a white hot spotlight, pleaded not guilty. Now some fans seem willing to forgive. You know, if if the charges were dropped and there wasn't enough evidence, then uh, he's off. But others say it will be hard to forget. People get away with a lot of things, and if you're a little more famous than others, it happens more often. Sports analysts say now it's on Kerry to repair the damage. I think in this community, there will be a higher standard that he's held to, even though, like you said, you know, that first touchdown, he's going to be right back on everyone's shoulders. A second chance that legal experts say comes from that key witness being unavailable, a fatal twist in cases like this. They would need to have a witness available at trial, number one. Um, who could say what happened. And if that person goes MIA? If it's, you know, the only witness, that can be very damaging to a case. And one point we heard a lot, people saying, hey, of course he's off the hook. He's Kadeem Carey. He's a huge mm. football star. That mm. attorney that we talked to says absolutely not. Notoriety, fame does not play a part in criminal proceedings like this. And by the way, if the attorney's office gets more evidence, they do have six months to refile those charges. Okay, we'll see what happens. Maggie, thanks so sure. much.